All the way up, Ronald Ellis, to 180 pounds. Here's Hall of Fame ring announcer, Jimmy Lennon Jr. Premier Boxing Champions presents a big night of action. Introducing to you first on my left, he is fighting out of the red corner with a record of 28 wins, three losses, and one draw. This is Matt Korobov. His record stands at 17 wins, one loss, two draws. Ellis. It is right now, touch gloves. And the bell rings, box. Good luck. Ronald Ellis in the blue and gray trunk. Or punch output is going to be the difference. Yeah, you know, he said he wanted this. Hasn't faced a pure southpaw since December of 2016. So, I mean, him gaining 14, almost 50. You know, he's got the power advantage, so why not go for the kill? Ellis just out of range before Korobov. Uh, Ellis rushing uh, Korobov, oh. but. I mean, how Korobov responds with the left hand, throws a left. Horse is almost 38 years of age and has had a long layup. Gone. Abner, you're early. Staying at distance, um, you know, not throwing much punches, but. Korobov fainting with the left. Korobov, though, not that busy either. They see him go to the power punch even more. He's thrown a bunch of right hands already. Uh, he uh, was not well prepared for this fight. Orbov said, I was happy when he accepted the fight at 160 pounds. Midsection. Ellis comes back with a right. Go. You know, he's always looking for that counter punch, so you really don't want to do. Bob and Ellis here at the fight sphere. Time. Right hand is his best power punch. Always important against the left. Now he's a good body puncher and he wants to accentuate that tonight. Frequent sparring partner for Canelo in San Diego. And Korobov able to come. I think it's gonna be important tonight to do it. Let's see if he can. You know, not so aggressive, his distance. Hands in this fight, there's a try at one right there. We're just deflecting that straight right off the face of Korba. The counter puncher, he's waiting for Ellis to make the, the mistakes here. Some lefty sparring in Los Angeles with former belt holder Gil in uncontested right. land accommodation and then about uh, wanting another shot at Charlo who... Korobov. Korobov, Bob, momentarily on the ropes. Bobbing and weaving. A uh, competition here, uh, Abner as Korobov fights compared to the cup of coffee that Ellis had. Bob again looking to dictate the terms of the early rounds, lands that the inside. Yet he's kind Gentlemen, of stopping the action break, there. Break that lead right hook. It is interesting, Korobov really wanted to be on the inside, but it's. Thanks, we are through two. Time. Let's go to Brian Custer. Yo simplemente me dedico a hacer mi trabajo en el gimnasio. Into round three, and Ellis has definitely come up more aggressive. Into Corbo so far, it doesn't look like that shoulder's bothering him. Of course, his weigh-in setback didn't help his cause, and they have had long stretches of inactivity, and it worked that jab in this fight, and something that it still he hasn't done. It's going to be tricky. And there, Korobov comes in with 61 pounds. Ellis came five pounds overweight, so... Yeah, that was a long time ago, Brian. I can't go by. Ellis, chronic right hand issues. Korobov coming off. Of course, Ellis, at the age of 31, needs this win. If he... Korobov has been off 12 months, 11 months, 13 months. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, nice left hand through the guard box. These are not the easiest rounds to judge, either. Uh, you know. Monitor throughout this fight, out. <laughs> yeah, and those are both issues. Reach advantage. Yes. So all of his punches look like pool cues. Yeah. Both Ronald. of them now in this clinch, trying to invest to the body. Short left. Queensbury appreciates. <laughs> 20 seconds left here in the third year. Mohegan Sun. Time. You know what I mean? When he's holding like that, make sure that you use your free hand. That, 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 that. Okay? Get your motion going. This is round. Ben in the corner, Charles Mooney in the Korobov corner in 1960. His back foot. And that's what they wanted from Korobov. I made Charles Mooney older than he is. He's a 1976. And a half remaining in the fourth, and it's a boxing match, although there needs to have an uptick in that offense as Korobov. This has been a core ball. I think really one of his best. Establish the, the jab, but there's that long reach of Elin and Olympia. Yeah, yes. not Korobov was a Russian. I mean, he's being effective. He's being the more aggressive uh, fighter in this fight. Uh, Howard Howard Davis, all the great uh, fighters for that Olympic team. Ellis said that his punch output would be the difference. It's there early on. There you go. This round for yeah. Korobov for sure. 
Oh, nice counter left. Kurt Shabalala, who was a very fine South African Olympian, not 1968. The medalist at rounds in the fight here. I mean, even though you can make a case for him winning others. Of Ellis. Yes, right. Ellis really not no showing. <laughs> Korobov coming in with a five. Under a minute left in the fourth. Ellis trying to put together his combination. Ooh, that's like that's good, yeah. oh. that score. And a little short right hand by Ellis, too, so they both... Work. I need my network. Doctor being called yeah. to the Seconds out. Corner. Seconds got to step out. Oh. Okay, he's got it. Your corner got it. Oh, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Korobov indicating that he can't stand on or. his left yeah. ankle. In his late 30s, these injuries piling up. Ellis will record the victory. See to suffer another injury in the middle of a fight, and and it appears at that point he might have twisted it. That we don't know. Uh, it it obviously career threatening Woo! for Matt Korobov, who was injured in back to back fights. Let's bring in a determination, but it was reported as an Achilles injury to the left leg. He is the winner by way of technical knockout. Ellis.